Good day everyone! I am Christopher Liam Zirasanis. Today I will teach you how to solve long division with remainders. Division is the complete opposite of multiplication. So if you have memorized your multiplication tables, it will be easier for you to divide. I have two examples. Five hundred eighty-nine divided by six. Six is the divisor, and five hundred eighty-nine is the dividend. First thing we will do is divide. When can we divide five and six? No. So we put eight. So now it's fifty-eight divided by six. Fifty-eight divided by six is nine. So we put nine on top of eight. step is to multiply. We will multiply 9 and 6. 9 times 6 is 54. So we will put 54 under 58. And we will subtract 58 and 54. The answer to that is 4. So we will put it There. Next step is to bring down 9 because 4 cannot be divided to 6. So we put 9 beside 4. And then we divide again. 49 divided by 6 is 8. So we put 8 over 9. Then we multiply again. 8 times 6 is 48. We will put 48 under 49. Then you subtract again. 49 minus 48 is 1. There are no numbers. There are no more numbers to bring down. And the number 1 is smaller than 6. So it is a remainder. So we put R beside 8. Then put 1 beside R. And there, the answer to 589 divided by 6 is 98 remainder 1. I have another example. 467. divided by 3. And again, the first thing we will do is divide. And also, 3 is the divisor and 467 is the dividend. So can we divide 4 and 3? Yes! So we will put 1. 4 divided by 3 is 1. We will put 1 on top of 4. And then, we multiply. We will multiply 1 and 3. 1 times 3 equals 3. So we put 3 under 4. And then, we subtract 4 and 3. 4 minus 3 is 1. And we 
would bring down 6. Because we can't divide 1 to 3. We will put 6 beside 1. And then we divide again. Three div 16 divided by 3 is 5. So we put 5 over 6. Then we multiply again. So, 5 times 3 is 15. So we put 15 under 16. Then subtract 16 and 15. 16 minus 15 is 1. Again, we can divide it to 3. So we bring down 7. And then we'll put 7 beside the 1. And then we repeat again. We divide again. So 3 divided by 17 divided by 3 is 5. So we put 5 over 7. That. And then we multiply. 5 times 3 is 15. So we put 15 under 17. And we subtract. 17 divided, I mean, 17 minus 15 is 2. And there are no more numbers to bring down. And also number 2 is smaller than 3. So it is a remainder. So again, we put an R beside 5. And then we put number 2 beside that R. And then there, the answer to 467 divided by 3 is 155 remainder 2. Thank you for watching everyone. I hope you learned something.